up guys devil dog gamer here and we are back playing some dcs and we have early access to the super carrier dlc which makes the carrier 10 times better i actually got access to it a while ago but for some reason it ended up in my junk mail and i completely missed it so it gives life to the carrier look at this it's bigger it feels larger it's alive i mean look at all the deck crews look at them so we're going to go ahead and do a launch and then try to do a case one recovery. We'll see about that. Uh, let me get my ground crew to remove the wheel chocks. Chief, remove the wheel chocks. Copy. All right, here we go. Now All right, we've got a nose wheel high, and we're going to go this way. After I turn off my parking brake, of course. All right, so we're going to go to Cat 1 over here. So the guy in the yellow standing over the cat is the man with the plan telling us where we're supposed to go. So we have to follow him to get all set up. All right, wings out. Okay, now we'll turn straight into him. Oh, nose wheel high is not on anymore. That's that's not good. All right, he wants us to go left. Keep it centered. Just keep coming forward, forward, forward. Always trust your ground guides. Left, forward. Okay. Whoa, what the hell? Stop. They're gonna go put the launch bar on me. Okay, he's telling okay. He's telling me to put my launch bar down, so I'm gonna put the launch bar down. And we go out here and they'll hook it up. Alright, so he wants me to go forward and get my bar over the shuttle, which takes a considerable amount of power. Stop. Getting me all hooked up. Bring the launch bar back in. There we go. All right, looking at you. I got you, friend. Go ahead and spool her up. Engine looks good. All right, here we go. And launch. Whoa, friend, what the hell? Okay. Well, we're airborne, man. So that's what it is. I'll do a quick little flyover so you guys can see it. I know, I know. Not enough speed to be doing that kind of garbage, huh? All right, and then we'll go in and attempt a landing. Keyword attempt. So here's the carrier all built up. Look at that. Look at that thing, man. It's crazy. All right, so we're going to try to do a case one. I'm probably going to crash since I haven't been doing carrier stuff in a while, but hey, it's worth a shot. All right, so we're going to go in for a landing, and I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to suck really bad at it. It's been a while, so we're going to contact the carrier. Let them know, hey, we're inbound.
So we're just going to get a little closer. Hopefully I don't have to really mess with the, the radios that much. It kind of let me focus on not killing myself. I'm going to go ahead and get my hook down now. Don't want to forget about that. See you at 10. See you at 10. Update state switched out. Stay 5.6. And it should automatically come up to me and talk to me once we get a little closer. And then everything's pretty much auto until I think I have to call ball. And then I have to just do that on my, you know, myself. Gonna keep going down a little bit until we're 800. And as you can see, we already have the long range light. It's flashing red, which means I'm way left of center line. If it was flashing green, I'm way right. If it's orange, I'm um, right there on center line. Everything's good. Don't worry about it. We're going to increase our speed a little bit. I don't know why we're well under 250 here, but we are. I'm going to lower our altitude just a bit. Now I'm gonna warn you guys, I am super bad at landing on a carrier. Like super, super, super bad. I suck at it. I don't know why. I just don't play the hornet enough, I guess, to be good. Okay, we've already called in, so hopefully it'll start picking us up here soon. The tower, there we go. Overhead angels one. There we go. Oop, little, little, little lower than I wanted to be. We're gonna try a little wide because I do need a little bit of room. Now we're flashing green because we're right. Okay, so now we'll do the air brake. Oh, we don't have an air brake. Oh, boy. I don't think I bound it. No, I didn't. Okay, cool. So we're going to go ahead and just get our gear down. And go flaps. Get on speed now, I think. That's that's pretty good. A little lower than I wanted to be, but hey, we'll fix that. Okay. Gotta throttle back just a tad bit more, because guess what? Gave ourselves a little bit too much there. There we go. Get a little more into there, okay. And let's go ahead and start our turn. I'm going to start getting a little lower. There we go. Mm, we're not losing. 
losing enough altitude. Okay, there we go. We should be good there. Going to be definitely high. Uh-oh. Um, Clara? Oh, bad. Bad. Bad, bad, bad. Bad news bears. Super bad news bears. We fucked that turn up real bad. Oh, boy. Giving it, giving it, giving it power. Oh, that hurt. Oh, that hurt so bad. The one wire. Okay, that was pathetic. Um, okay, but I'm going to tell you right now, it's the first time I've landed on the carrier in God knows how long. So, uh, definitely going to get yelled at by somebody for that. Because that was, uh, that was rough, man. Everyone with their judgmental eyes over there. <laughs> so much more room to maneuver over here, man. We'll pull up next to the weapons locker. Elevator. Well, anyways, boys. This is the preview of the, uh, the new Super Carrier, which is just amazing. Everything about it is just cool as hell. I'm just telling you, this thing is super badass. And I cannot wait to play more of it. Dude, look at this thing. It's just su super cool. Definitely be learning a lot more about the Carrier and playing the hell out of it. Can't wait to do the LSO station. It's going to be amazing to actually work on that. But uh, if you guys want to see some more of the Super Carrier, let me know in the comments below. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.